This is our B-side defense from middle position. The majority of the time, the enemy is going to attempt to plant the bomb at B, and this is where we go the majority of the time to defend such a plant. We fail pretty miserably on the first few shots with this guy, but we will make up for it. Stay behind this wall to our left. It provides you cover. Sometimes you get shot at, and bullets will penetrate the wall, and guys will come up there. Sometimes we plant claymores, sometimes we don't. Depends how aggressive the enemy is. If they are aggressive and they rush our position, then we will plant claymores. And we'll show an example of that. So the bomb's been planted. There's still two, a uh, couple of guys left that we have to take care of, so we're just searching around. Guys will usually uh, perch up there to try and take sniper shots at guys defusing. Uh, there's one right there. I really don't know why he went prone there. And we get the defuse. Good job, team. Get ready for the next round. Okay, here's the same uh, thing as last round. Only we are going to place claymores. Always place one at the bottom of the stairs, or at or at the top. Again, change up your positions and place a claymore here, and that would have caught the guy in the last round. That's a very important claymore, and uh, it defends you. There was actually one time last night I got caught because I was scoped in, and I didn't see the guy jump up. I didn't have my claymore there, and uh, he blew me away. So it's an important claymore to put down. But there are occasions where I want to rush right up to that position so I can catch... Uh, the guy who might be rushing to uh, be the plant. So we do have a viewpoint of the B target as well as the middle tar uh, the middle area where you usually find enemy snipers as well as that left hand area but you don't want to stick your head out too far because you're going to end up uh, getting your head taken off with the sniper. So just wait and listen. You know the guy's over there. He's got UAV. We don't have jammer on. So he knows we're here. But we'll see what he does. And we don't take the juggernaut down. So that's where that uh, claymore comes in handy and we no, sc no scope him to finish him off. But there's still one left. But we know the bomb's at B, so we're just going to keep our eye out. And wait patiently. And there he is. Tried to sneak up on me, did you? Not going to work. Okay, same thing. Again, we're placing claymores this time. Like I said, you can place them at the bottom of the stairs or at uh, just at the top of the stairs. And again, from round to round, you want to change it up. Obviously, these aren't uh, the same round or rounds in the same game. But if you are playing in the same game, you want to change up the position of your claymores, except for that front claymore. You pretty much one in that location. This is where we fail four shots with the sniper rifle on this guy. But we make up for it with a headshot. And there's that claymore. Yeah, you get guys coming up there probably maybe 30% of the time or whatever. But uh, the claymore is well worth it. And we catch another guy trying to plant. We've got UAV, but it's three on one. We know where he has to go to get the bomb, so we're not going to use it. Wait and listen. Looks like our guy's firing at somebody over there on B side. Cover me! I'm reloading. You can hear somebody.
And our teammate finishes him off. Get ready for the next round. Search and destroy. Alright, another middle defense. This time without um, claymores. But you can see how quickly the enemy gets down to B, right? And that's why sometimes we don't put claymores. So we can get up there and we can catch the guy that's rushing right in there. And that's actually a bad position to be trying to plant. If you watch our offense video, we'll show you the proper position that you want to be in when you're planting the, the bomb on offense. He's too vulnerable there. He's trying to protect himself from the far, the far side and the two-story, but timing-wise, nobody can be up there to try and get him. So he needs to defend himself from me in the middle position. Okay, so this time we're going to the right-hand side. We're going to toss a grenade, hopefully catch some rushers that are going to plant the bomb at B. We're going to lay two claymores down, one at the bottom here, just inside the door, and one at the top of the stairs. And we're going to go over and see if we can see anybody that we can snipe. Again, you just want to inch your way out little by little. And uh, catch guys. If you go out too far, you're going to end up getting sniped. Because guys are looking for you up there. That's one of the major spots they look for to catch you um, from a sniper position up here. So we move over. Sometimes you'll find guys sniping from down there. We have a good view of the bomb, or the target, sorry. And that's exactly where guys might be located uh, sniping. So I think um, we've got a close by enemy. We can hear him moving around. Uh, he stopped. Not sure what he's doing. Maybe he saw the claymore down below, not sure. But we're going to take another shot just to give him a little bit of incentive to come up and get us. Now he knows for a fact we're up here. And we catch him coming up with a second claymore and our pistol. Okay, I know I've done a bunch of these to be defense from middle, but I'm gonna do it again. Um, I tried messing around in this game, and we got our asses handed to us. And I think the last two rounds, I was like the only guy left. So I kind of got pissed off here, and I went back to what works. And what works for me is the defense from this middle position. So this is why we're doing it again. We got one guy that just ran across. Um, it be two guys now, and as you'll see, our teammates are going to get their asses kicked. I didn't lay down claymores just because they had previously um, planted the bomb at B both times fairly quickly. So I'm a little bit defenseless here. Um, they could come out the backside very quickly. So we know there's guys in at A. So we're going to go over and check out and see what's going to go on. See what's going on here. Do you see one guy coming across there? We drop down. We smoke him. Now we gotta check the target because they could be planting, and there's a guy planting. Now we're kind of in not a very good position here. We check the other sniper spot across the the road, and what do you know? There's a guy there. So we grab him. They know where we are. So we're gonna come come around. I can hear somebody. I plant a claymore, and I get really lucky here. I get a kill with the claymore. I got my UAV. And what really pisses me off here is it looks like the guy's in the spawn. And as soon as I go to hit him to take him out, he's firing at me. It's like, were you trying to bait me or something? I don't know. Or if he just came back to the game, he's taking a piss, whatever. Anyways, we're going to try and track him down since we have UAV. And he's coming across. Probably should have kept his distance. And we take him out with a headshot and we get an airstrike. So I want to show that last example. Hope you like it. Get ready for the next round.